Hello and welcome back. This is Tron at Homegrown Audio. Today we are here because this has been a ridiculously long break, but my negligence towards video editing is getting bypassed now by my O of this new glitch machine multi-effect processor thingy. The name is Infiltrator. And for those of you who don't know Devious Machines, here is the link. It is a multi-effect MIDI and audio triggered, whatever you want. Also, sequencer inside it. It's a glitch machine. It has loads of filter types and all these effects. And then it has a sequencer here. Each one of these lanes has an envelope, LFO kind of thingy. These envelopes, you can paint them or randomize them. Has uh, you know, it has swing. It's super cool. You can make more intricate grids. It's awesome for what we do here. Let's do this on an eighth. Each step will be one eighth. And here you can randomize the steps on each lane. On each envelope, you got tons of shapes. You can draw presets or just draw your own weird art there. Down here is the MIDI or audio trigger selection and settings. Well, you select what will be triggering your sequences. The audio trigger settings, you got to tune them a bit for correct triggering. So basically, you can trigger the sequence with audio or MIDI here. And also, there are macro controls up here, and you can just click here and then just get any parameter in there, well, from anywhere in the machine. I won't use it as a MIDI trigger or audio trigger this time. First, I want to use the sequencer in the VST. Now here on the first lane, I'll turn on the filter and this envelope is one bar long. So it's going to be filtering up and down each half bar. Let's see how it sounds. So here on a second lane, let's get something different, maybe some FM. Frequency is the pitch of the FM source. The amount is how much FM amount you're going to give the audio and character is the type of waveform for the FM source. Here's the envelope. And here is the audio envelope with attack, hold, decay and gate. So let's get this envelope opening the frequency from low to high. Again, a bar length. Let's check it out. I mean, you can see how powerful this can be. All these effects are top quality, sound very nice. The looper is very useful, actually. It's like a beat repeat. Let's just get a couple of dots here on the sequencer and see what we get here. You can sync it or not.
from just a little bit of tweaking, we got pretty far from this. And it's fairly simple, super intuitive. Here on the master, the drive can go before the effects or the effects before the drive. There is a compressor which has four different settings from mild to aggressive. Really outstanding tool by Devious Machines. You shouldn't miss it at all, so go get it as soon as you can. Well, that is all for today. I hope this was useful and fun. I know it's been pretty slow here. I've been doing the live streams, but uh, a lot of work in the studio, which is good, but I haven't been able to put in the, the time for the channel. Well, you know how it is. But really big ups to all my patrons. Thanks a lot for your support. I could not be doing this without you. Well, anyways, as always, thank you for watching and see you next time. Thank you.